individuals that had that have uh, helped us with our freedom. Sergeant, your turn. Should I call you Sergeant now? Uh, Eric captain? is fine. Eric <laughs> okay. is great. That's what he said to me. I said, I wanna, what should I call you? Yes. Well, you made it to captain, though. I did. I in did. In Afghanistan. I did. Now, where do you serve? So now I serve with the Travis Mannion Foundation. So we're headquartered here, not too far away in Doylestown. We mm -hmm. have offices here in San Diego, Washington, D.C. So we're very much a national foundation. Remind us of Travis. So Travis was a Marine, Marine officer who was killed in Iraq. He gave the ultimate sacrifice for our country in 2007. Um, received a silver star for his actions on that day, saving his own men. And so now we have the Character Does Matter program that you're also in charge of. But this, yes. this kind of uh, honors people who've made the sacrifice by reaching out to our kids. Exactly. So what we like to do is we like to take our military veterans and our survivors of the fallen, link them with youth, high school, college students, and really teach them about character development and, and leadership development. Yeah. And uh, we think that's a great way to honor those who've, who've given the ultimate sacrifice. And when you were talking about this, because, I mean, who better to learn about leadership and things when it comes to life than from someone who's served? But you said this is not trying to get them to enlist, right? Absolutely not. No, I always tell kids, I, I hope you've never had to serve a day in uniform because it is, you know, that means that our, our country needs that. And I don't want our country to have to need that. So mm -hmm. um, it's the great attributes that we teach, integrity and grit and resilience and things that we as veterans often have to rely on and, and uh, cultivate within ourselves, we like to pass on. But no, it is not a recruiting tool. Do you have a website? Uh, we do, travismanion.org. Yeah. Okay. Facebook, social media, Twitter, all of it. I saw you all out there in Doylestown. Yes. It was a week ago, about you know, a week ago Friday. Right, right. Great, yeah. great yeah. family. And with this program, how many students do you guys help out each year? Uh, each? We, we've, so far, we've touched uh, over 150,000 students wow. with our programs. Good so career. every year, it's growing and uh, expanding into different markets. So fantastic. And it's also important, I think, especially that our kids know what all it takes and what people are doing out there for us and for our country so they don't forget as well. Right, exactly. So we do, like I said, it's all about honoring those who've given an ultimate sacrifice, passing on those lessons of leadership and, and life that, uh, that our veterans have had to learn sometimes the hard way. Thank you both for coming in. You are Thank two you. perfect guests on Memorial Day. Thank you. Great. All right. Certainly inspiring us to remember and honor those who've served. By the way, keep sending pictures of your family members who've